Hey, this is going to be a quick and easy tutorial on how to manage a lot of YouTube messages if you have that problem. Uh, what I, I, got these, uh, I got these tips from this book, Getting Things Done by David Allen. I just thought I'd you know, source where the ideas came from. I didn't make it up. Basically, um, uh, I use Gmail and I highly recommend using Gmail and if you're not using Gmail, you can probably do something similar to this using whatever system you have. But Gmail has uh, filters and labels. So what you can see up here is there's, these are filters. You got labels here. Uh, to explain quickly what the filter is, the filter is like a rule uh, so that when your email comes in, this rule will say, okay, this email goes you know, here or automatically delete this email or whatever. You set the rules. That's what the filter is. And a label... A label is something that just, it's just, you're just putting like a label, like you put a label on, you know, anything. It's just, it's just labeling it so you know what it is. So the easiest way to think about it is it's like a folder, but it's not like a folder where when you put it in a folder, you can't put it in another folder. It's more like, you know, like your, your item, your piece of paper can have multiple labels. So that's kind of cool, but... If that's hard to understand, just look at it like a folder. So what I've done now, I used to have it, I used to just have one label, one folder called YouTube and one filter that sent all the messages from YouTube into that folder automatically and archived them so they wouldn't go in my inbox. And that was enough. But now I'm getting more traffic, so I, I split it up. So I'll explain to you what I have real quick. Basically, I have... I have how many? One, two, three, four, five. I have five. I know that's fuzzy. My camera sucks, whatever. But I have <clears throat> five labels. I have one for comments, one for messages, one for videos people want to share with me, one for subs, and one for videos people share with me. I Maybe my labeling is wrong. And you'll notice in front I have a little exclamation point. I got that from his book. Basically that, you know, for alphabetical order, it just shoves those all the way to the top of my labels list. And so that's that's the actually I just told you what the labels are, but you can do this whole process when you set up a filter you are you are asked you know you can make a new label as you set it up so and here are the filters I have basically they're all for the YouTube they're all from YouTube and what it does with those is I have in the subject if the subject has comment put it in the comment uh uh, label give it the comment label you know put it in the comment folder if it has message message folder blah 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 etc and real quick I wish I had like some high-tech setup so I could make it all fucking gangster but this is what I'm rolling with and here I'm going to create a new filter now in Gmail if you want to create a new filter you got it right right there right where you search your mailbox right there you have create new filter click that and you're gonna have the from thing here, actually I'll, I'll grab the information so you know what I'm talking about. All, all your emails from YouTube come from service at youtube.com. So what you would do is you just paste, you know, you just put that in there. That's service at youtube.com. For the subject, you know, if it, was, if it was messages or comments, I'm gonna type comments real quick. Sorry, comments. So subject, I have comments, right? And you can test, you can test it before you go to the next step. You can test it. So you click test and uh, something's wrong <laughs> from service. At, oh, because I don't have any, uh, I don't have any messages that have that. Basically, you can, you can test it and it'll, it'll show you. I just deleted all my, I deleted all. Oh, here, here. I just got one comment. I just got one comment. Here you go. Test the search and what the... What the F? What the F? Oh, there's no S. Sorry, there's no S on the comment. It's just comment. So I put that in. Or there might be an S on comment. I don't know. But you get it set up. Subject. There, I tested it. Next. Next step. I click next step. Uh, we're in the next step. And what I check, I check mark box. Skip the, inbo skip the inbox so it doesn't go into my main inbox. So I don't want to be bombarded with YouTube right away. And then you click on apply the label. It's going to ask you to choose the label. And like you can see all the labels I have here. And you can go right here. Oh, wait. Oh, no. New labels right here. So you can just click new label. You click new label. You can enter the name of the label in here. 
and make sure before you create filter make sure you hit apply on there's only one comment there but when I was doing it earlier this morning there were hundreds of comments there you apply it on that comment it'll move all your mail and you do that for messages comments uh, video replies I don't think I did it for video replies messages comments subscribers whatever and then you can you know check that once or twice a day or hover around it all day whatever you feel like doing and I hope that makes somebody's life easier. It's going to make mine. Peace.